Now, the building of South Africa's first 100% renewable energy charging station is about to begin. We know how bad the uh, blackouts are, and they're probably going to get a bit worse, so this is good news. It was a groundbreaking ceremony held at the Volmerenstadt uh, area in the northwest province yesterday. Now, unlike other charging stations that have to connect to ESCOM's grid, this one is the zero carbon charging station, going to be completely solar powered. So it's the right part of the country for it. Andres Malharbe making time for us. He's from the organization. Hello, Andres. Good to have you with us. And this was bound to happen with technology moving the way it is, charging stations having to move completely away from ESCOM, because ironically, you have to use ESCOM to charge them. Those days are behind you. Well done. Tell me about it. Hello, hello guys. Hello, viewers. Yes, you know, it's, um, it was a wonderful day for us, uh, and what was really amazing was to have the whole local community out there uh, in force. Um, you know, it's uh, uh, the problem with an electric car is that it actually uses a, a lot of power. You, you could equate uh, the batteries you have at home, which is, you know, normally a normal battery 3.5 kilowatts. A car battery is over 80, so it's 20 times more. In fact, when you charge a car, a car absorbs as much power as, as, as 200 houses at, at, at high speeds. Mm -hmm. So it's really critical to be able to have enough power to give people a satisfactory charging experience. And, and that we define as between 15 and 20 minutes. And most chargers out there at the moment will charge the, the same amount of power in, in, in between one and a half and four hours, which I just don't think is good enough.